Hello people of internet, today is the 30th of March 2010 and this is a vlog. Hey, how you doing? Um, I just got back home from the sneak preview of the movie Kick-Ass. I went into this movie not knowing exactly what to expect. Uh, the lovely people at Universal had given me some uh, sneak preview passes. And they also shouted a whole bunch of Twitterers. Uh, half of those Twitterers went and saw it tonight with me. And a whole bunch of Twitterers are going to be seeing it on Wednesday as well. So I'm not going to spoil it for those guys. And I'm not going to spoil it for the rest of you. Because uh, those of you in Australia, the movie comes out 8th of April. So that will be next week. So what's the movie about? The movie... Actually, no. I'm not even going to spoil the movie. I really enjoyed the fact that I didn't know anything about the movie. I walked into the cinemas not knowing. I walked out of the cinemas loving the movie. Uh, it's a comic book film. And it's filmed slightly different to all those other comic book films, i.e. it's actually films like a comic book. Not the not the visual styling or anything like that, but simply how the movie, the pacing of the movie, the ultra-violence that they used as, uh, in the movie, um, it was very, very comic booky. People are either going to really like this film or not. Um, the people who like the film are most likely going to be people who are fans of comic books. I am not even quite sure if this movie is based on a comic book. I've got a funny feeling that it is because it does ring a bell to me. Um, but I check right now but at the moment I am uploading a video to YouTube and that completely just decimates my internet. I can't do anything when I'm uploading. The movie was uh, very comic stylized to a point where the violence as I mentioned was very 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 violent. Uh, it's very 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 comic booky so a lot of people might find that a bit weird because uh, normally when you see a comic book movie like X-Men or uh, Batman, um, Fantastic Four, Spider-Man the violence in that movie, the fight scenes, etc., are your normal Hollywood-style fight scenes. This was just... it was awesome. It was, it was very... think Kill Bill. But... no, I don't, I don't want to ruin it for you, so yeah, just think Kill Bill and... it's that level of violence. Maybe not as bloody. For Kick-Ass, without actually talking about the movie, because I want to give you guys uh, the best experience without knowing anything, um, I give it five stars. Maybe four. Stars. No, actually, I'll give it four stars because it's not a brilliant movie. There's definitely some faults. The movie went on too long. There was way too much character development. At the same time, there wasn't enough character development for certain characters as well. Um, there was unnecessary plot lines. With, uh, I think the, there was a romance in there that they just chucked in. Well, it felt like they just chucked into the the script simply to make the producers, the the studios happy, but. Uh, good, good movie nonetheless. It will be great to own on Blu-ray. I can imagine the uh, the extras and the deleted scenes and all that would be quite good. But anywho, the time is ten to one in the morning. I'm just waiting for this YouTube video to upload, and then I'll upload this video, and then I will go straight to bed because I haven't been to bed since Saturday night. I mean, I've been to bed, but I haven't had proper sleep, and it's ten to one, and I'm actually tired right now, so I'm probably going to fall asleep, and it's really, really good because. I don't sleep often. Like like this last night, I, I had like a three hour sleep or two and a half hour sleep. And it doesn't count. Why am I talking about this? I don't know. So I'll catch you guys tomorrow.